and, and this is the leading story there. And this is the drought, which appears to be covered on most of the front covers today mm. or tomorrow. Let me try and cover this in the least most boring way. <laughs> 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 to cover the drought story. So, uh, yes, England is likely to be, de to be declared officially in drought on Friday. What we're talking about is water restrictions, fire risks, farming, hardship. Uh, what it essentially also means is that the, the water companies can now start doing horse, um, hose pipe bans by themselves. They don't need to wait for the government to do any of that stuff. Temperatures likely to reach 36 degrees uh, in some places over the weekend. It's the driest nine-month period since 1976. Southeast England received less than 10% of its usual rainfall in July. So things are getting serious. Driest July since 1935. All this stuff is not going... And, and going back to those three things there, water restrictions, I mean, host pipe bams and stuff, I know that's hard for people's gardens, but, you know, not cleaning people's cars, it's not the end of the world. Fire risks, they've done these, like, aerial shots of the country, and there just seems to be... It's just lots of... Sort of yellow. I mean, we've got this, uh, this yeah. photograph here. As that's well, a fire, that. by the way. That, if that is a fire. It, that's a fire. To illustrate right. the fire risk. Yeah. And, uh, but they, but the, one of the things I hadn't really appreciated until reading this article is the farming hardship because mm. already what they're going to mean is it's threatening crop yields, raising the prospects of even higher food prices. Um, and that's not what we need at the moment. This is bad news uh, generally. I'm just going to throw something in here from a, this was a tweet from Evolve Politics the other day and they mm. pointed out that, uh, Private water companies are leaking 1.1 trillion litres of water every year, which is enough to, uh, to fill 450,000 Olympic swimming pools. Would you now, use it for that, though? Um, I mean, I'm not, I don't think they're suggesting that would be the best usage of the water. Yeah, it seems are. ridiculous at this, this time to be worried about filling Olympic swimming pools. <laughs> I mean, look, they have a point, don't they? That, you know, why can't these people fix their pipes? Because that's what it's down to. Absolutely. They have leaky pipes. Well, and they yeah, have absolutely. You wouldn't, you wouldn't accept it from, a, from an oil company. If an oil company was leaking 1.6 trillion gallons or whatever of oil into, like, oh, well. into the soil. <laughs> yeah. So there's obviously the technology there to, to make pipes that don't leak because we've got it with, with oil and with other, yeah. uh, other chemicals. Uh, so yeah, they, they need to, they need to, uh, I think because we've been, uh, used to plentiful water, because it just falls out of the sky for free. It does. Like a, like a blessing from God. So, you know, we're, we're, we haven't been so concerned about a little bit seeping out. Yeah. No. Um, but then on the other hand, I mean, that, that water that does seep out, I mean, because I've been walking around, uh, the city looking at the trees and wondering where they get the water from. So maybe that water goes into the trees or something. And then if we stop all the leaks, you know, the trees all die. Um, I don't think that's how it works. Is that in the article? I don't no, remember that it's bit. Not, it's not in but, the article. Well, the, the article's all doom and gloom. It is doom and gloom. <laughs> it's so all it's doom and gloom. It's like saying we're all going to burn and there's going to be well, crop, crop yields. For most people, we're just going to get a suntan, have a nice barbecue. Yeah. Well, I just, I just want to say one final tweet is that we're talking about those pipes. You know, since water was privatised, hundreds of billions of pounds have been just taken out of this country, taken to investors and have not been re-put right. back in. Out that's, of this country? Yeah, out of this country to, for, to foreign companies and foreign people. I think that's a bit of nonsense. I think most... <laughs> that's why I'm... Look, private... it was on Twitter. It has to be true. <laughs> I mean, I think, Josh, I mean, look... It's... I think if you've got a pension, which most people do, then the money that, from private investments, from private companies, goes into your pension. So it's not like the Fine, money's just but, being okay, spirited but they away. they could be doing more to prevent the rest of us having mm. to cut back on water.